Don't worry about how it look right now, man. Ooh, he got loose on me that time. YouTube man, we back at it again today, man. In the snow, in the cold, man. I had to put my mask and my coat on, man. I couldn't take it, but man, yeah, man. As y'all can see, it's snowing, man. It's snowing pretty bad too. So what I wanted to do today is, man, let's take the Q60 out. I said fuck it. Uh, I do got. I gotta make a little run today. I ain't going nowhere too far. So I said fuck it. I haven't drove the Q60 in the snow since I got it. Uh, especially since it's been built and especially since it's had this tire on it so oh um, man it's gonna be interesting to see what it do man I don't know what they expect but before we do anything man I got to get it all cleaned off started up uh, running it haven't ran in like two weeks since I picked it up from the uh, getting a trans put in it so man we about to see what it do started right up with the 85 in it so this thing ain't ran in like two weeks, huh? I like when the snow like this, man. I don't like when it get all super hard and cold. Shit. This snow I can deal with. So I got it cleaned off for the most part. Shit, I don't I don't feel like it's necessary to knock all that off. It's gonna fall off as soon as we start driving probably. But man. I don't know, and I'm nervous about this. Like I said, I ain't drove this thing in the snow at all, let alone since it's been built. So, man, we about to see what it do. This for y'all. Car all warmed up and everything, man. Um, just explain a little more what went on with the car. Um, the last video I did explain to y'all that the trans did go out. Uh, we put the new trans in, everything is uh, perfect. I'm just waiting on a few more parts. We're gonna do a few more adjustments to it. Just because I don't want to come out the same that it was last year. Car got the power. Um, now it's all about us making sure that the car worked and the car putting the power down and being able to leave how it's supposed to and all that so uh that's next on the list uh, i want to do the all-wheel drive controller we might snatch the trans out and put a converter in there um then i'm putting wheels and tires on it and then we're going to fine tune it because like i said before it, it never even got fine tuned we just really put pretty much threw something in there um, until we got everything right and by the time we got everything right the trans was already messed up because when I got the car um, the car was low on trans fluid for some reason and um, I drove it like that for a minute and down the line shit that shit took its toll and um it, it wore it wore the trans out I already knew that was gonna happen that's why I had a backup trans in the first place but man everything worked out for me um, we back in action um, so I can make this video for y'all today. Man, then we almost out of gas. Hey, man. I always wanted to use this mold in the car. And never really, um, never really got to use it. So we're going to use it today. Um, they say it's pretty much supposed to make the pedal a little softer for you. Um, take some power out of it from when you really hitting the pedal. Um, I don't know if it does anything like suspension-wise or nothing. I doubt it. But uh, we're going to see how it works, man. Y'all ready? actually don't feel too bad yeah it actually don't feel too bad it kind of feel like my great car so far oh yeah man y'all don't usually see this from from the uh gopro footage when i post the races but the wheel alignment is off bad in here man i gotta get that fixed too before we um before we get back to racing before i go to the track or anything like that Bro, like I said, the road ain't that bad. It's slushy on the road, but they put salt down over here, so the road ain't really that bad. Let's see what it do from a dead dead. Hold on. That wasn't too bad at all. Oh, 
doing snow drag racing this year, man. We doing snow drag racing this year. This mud feel good. This, I, uh, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I mean, it is kicking the traction on like a motherfucker, but for it to be able to pull through this shit, it don't feel bad at all. Daily driving, man. I, I don't drive this car daily no more at all, really. Um, only reason I did today just to do the video for y'all guys and see myself out driving the snow. Cause like I said, I, I never drove it in the snow. But man, it's it doing good. Um, if I ever have to hop in it, I wouldn't mind honestly because the drive is driving good. And it's, it's a little rough on the bumps. I ain't drove. I haven't drove um, drove it in a minute. Man, they ride rough over these bumps. They ride so stiff, man. Uh, sport car life. Well, I think we gotta try sport mode, man. I think we gotta try sport mode, sport plus action. It did too good in the snow mode, so let's see the difference. Let's see if it make a difference um, hitting it in, in sport mode over that. Shit, man, I am so fucking amazed with this car right now. Even the, even the F one fifty got its hazards on, man. And we doing full pulls in, in, the, in the snow and ice. And it doesn't even, it don't even feel, um, it don't feel bad at all. Like I said, it don't feel bad at all, man. It's pulling straight through it. Man, this car is a work of art, I'll tell you that. Ooh, it got loose on me that time. Let me see, can I slide it? It, want, it don't even want me to slide. It's trying to straighten itself out so much. There it go. About a three car accident right there. Literally only been about two seconds since I just came through here. Yeah, man, um, like I said, the car about to go back to KB's in a minute anyway. Um, <coughs> um, so, I'm not about to be driving it anyway. Um, plus, all the plans I got, I just don't want to beat on the car no more. Uh, stuff like this, I never do with my car. Um, but I'm doing it for y'all today, man. So, make sure y'all do like, comment, subscribe, and all that. And give me the likes, man. I'm beating on the car for y'all. Um... But man, we only got about two more months of this, so we'll be back to racing soon. So I have plenty of content, um, and the car should be back better than ever. Um, shout out to everybody that's helping KB BTW. I probably have my boy uh, eBay in a lot of in a lot of the videos through the summer, man. We supposed to do a lot of collabs. Um, I got a few more people that supposed to be doing collabs with me this summer, man. A lot more content. I know I. I've been seeing that all the time, and um, we really don't get it done. It's really because living the two different lives of being the cameraman and being the YouTuber. But now I got my stuff in order, and uh, man, I'm gonna be pushing everything out. Um, I always do record when I go out, no matter what. Most of the time, I just don't put the content out. But this year, I promise you guys, uh, stay tuned, man. We gonna get everything together. We gonna, I'm gonna be posting almost daily because everything is going to be towards uh, pushing and showing you guys the build, showing you all the stuff that I do, man, because we race so much. We do so much in the summertime. Uh, my events, uh, pour your own puddle at my island, everything. Um, so, I'm really excited for the shit that I got coming with this car. Uh, we never even got into appearance-wise. The car is still all original. We never even got into appearance-wise. I was so focused on um, getting the boat on, getting it full boat on, and all that stuff. So, this year, we're doing everything, man. Um, and everything is going on the channel, so you guys will see it all. For all my guys that text me on TikTok, um, Instagram, and all that stuff, I'm going to be fulfilling your requests, because y'all do text me a lot, ask me to do certain stuff. Um, I'm going to be showing all that stuff you guys want. My v, uh, VQ37, guys, the great car will be back will be back for sure this year um really i was just driving it last year after the accident i didn't even really want to 
posted or nothing like that, but I'm probably getting it wrapped and um, it'll be back out, be back together how it's supposed to be. And I have more content with that car too. But man, like I said, we got more content coming, man. I'm definitely doing a chrome delete this year. I want to get rid of the chrome. Um, man, I put this light on last year. I guess I got the cheat one, man. It only works for about a week or two. So we put a new um, glowing emblem on it. I want to change the mirrors because they're getting kind of old. Um, what else? Of course, the new tires and stuff. I want to get a custom badge made for the back. Um, I may tint out the back headlights, put a new wing on it. We're going to make the windows a little darker. Um, man, we're doing a lot of stuff, man. This thing, oh, not, most importantly, we're changing the wheels. And don't worry about how it look right now, man. It's because I'm on the incline. I know y'all probably going to be in the comments talking about um, why the car squat like that. No, it's because it's on the incline. So stay tuned. If y'all got any questions or any videos y'all do want me to do on the car, man, tap in. Let me know. We can do anything. Um... Or any questions just about stuff I have did to the car. Like I said, I pretty much explained a lot in my last video. Um, when I showed all the parts that I put on and stuff. But it's little, it's little, uh, how do you say it? Tricks, tricks of trade to, to do the sh shit I did do to it. And um, little different stuff with it, man. Different problems we came into. So you can ask me anything. Um, sensors that I had to change, all type of stuff man you can ask me anything so um comment below hit me on instagram a lot of y'all follow me on instagram it's gonna be in the description um hit me man let me know what's up stay tuned subscribe to the channel man we got way more coming for the channel on the way man let's go I